Previously, we find a few problems in Gemini's Korean Air A380. The good news is some of them are gone in this Air France. I reviewed this Gemini Air France A380 in 10 categories. This model comes with the official Air France merchandise packaging. It's a special official Air France limited edition with only 380 pieces released. I'll give this elegant packaging an 8. This model comes with magnetic landing gear and a display stand. The aircloft looks very good on the stand. I'll give accessories an 8. This Gemini mode has captured the look and feel of the A380 very well. The heavily rounded nose and the huge forehead are very well shaped. It has a very well made massive vertical stabilizers here. But the gaps at the attachment between the wings and the fuselage are rather obvious. It's a bit annoying to me. I would say there's still a lot of room for further improvement. I'll give the mode a 7. These four GP7200 see-through engines look very realistic. The fan blades are all in correct shape and scale. But unlike the other Gemini A380 models, this batch of Air France GP7200 has no white apostrophe spinner spirals. This mistake is minor but crucial. Therefore, I can only give an 8. All the major details are finely represented by either printing, attachment parts, or engraving. The air intakes and the APU exhaust are especially good looking. The only complaint I will make is the landing lights on the wings. They are only printed. Any lights on the no skill leg are missing. Anyhow, I will still give a 9. I think Gemini has done a very good job to present Air France livery here. The size and typeface of all the logos and titles are very detailed and precise. Basically, there is nothing missing. I'll say it deserves a 9. For painting, I don't see any color discrepancy here. The French tricolor applied here is sharp and precise. I'll give painting a 9. In our unboxing of Korean Air's A380 in an other video, we found the two wingtips have a huge height difference and vertical stabilizers leans towards the starboard side. Well, we don't see this problem here. This Air France is very finely built. I'll give a 9. You can see the nose gear is not sitting in far enough. So there is a very awkward gap there, and the two wheels are too far apart. The problem is the same with the closed gear doors. It looks really bad. Even though the main gears can tilt and look handsome from this angle, they are very loose and look awkward from the front. So I will give undercarriage a 7. This Air France official limited edition is really a treasure. I bet the chance for the airline to reproduce another batch of co-branded official A380 is relatively small, given that the fleet is already retired. So, I think it is worth an 8 for value. 
I'll give this Air France A380 a total of 82 points in my Eric Index. Do you agree with this rating? Are you one of the 380 owners of this limited edition? Leave a comment to let us know. See you next time.